Okay, we have here uh, the new Cafe Dash Link 4. Um, you've seen my other three videos with a quick walkthrough. Um, this is a follow up. Um, just to note, this is in a 2013 Scion FRS running the Toyota specific uh, Toyota Universal unit. Um, this is pretty much plug and play. The only different, only thing that had to be done is um, to remove the steering wheel controls wire um, because of course this car does not have steering wheel controls. Um, this video is to show you that torque does indeed work on this. Uh, it is not rooted, is not adjusted. This is exactly how it came from the factory. So you'll see down here I have the cafe supplied OBD2 device plugged in. It is working. Um, just to show you, it is paired. I'll sh open the system preferences or system uh, preferences from the um, drop-down shade. There's other ways to get to it, but this is the easiest way. Um, there's bl uh, Bluetooth, and you can see maybe that it is connected to OBD2. So that is connected. We're working. Um, I have Torque Pro installed as it came from the factory. Um, they're nice enough to install that. Um, this is the car home screen as I've shown you in other um, videos. I have customized it a little bit more um, with my own widgets. This is a car widget, um, Google Play Music widget, um, Torque widget which does not come with it. That was a two dollar extra kind of nice. Shows you the um, speed and everything once you've actually launched the OBD2 um, app. Right now it's not working because, of course, I haven't launched it yet. Um, Google Now, and then of course I've cleaned up my icon arrangement a little bit more. So you'll see that once you uh, have time to play with the device, you can very much make it your own. Um, but the most important thing is torque. So let's launch torque. And boom, we're in torque. So you'll see I'm car is running, my revs respond. It does indeed work. Um, so of course all the other functions of it will work. You know, there's fault codes, all that sort of stuff. My car doesn't have any. Um, you know, all the real-time information you look for with torque. This works built in. So you'll see everything's going as with the car so you see of course I am running the car so pretty cool so that's torque on the cafe dash link four um, of course all the various versions of the cafe dash link four should uh, should work exactly the same um, I just was lucky enough to get the Toyota Universal one which does uh, does work in the FRS so that's the torque on the in the FRS with the Cafe Dash Link 4. Pretty cool.